Tennessee is one of only a handful of states monitoring an active presence of a foreign invasive insect. As we get closer to summer, the chances of seeing this spotted lanternfly will increase. As News 2's Corey Johnson reports, you can help the state in detecting them. Spotted lanternflies are back in Middle Tennessee, and the Tennessee Department of Agriculture is keeping a close watch. The invasive black and red plant hopper is from Asia, and one you might even mistake for a butterfly, depending on their stage of life. The early instar nymphs are more the size of like a, a tick. As the adults come out, you know, they're going to be more mobile. State entomologist Cindy Bilbrey tells News 2 the insect sucks out the tree's nutrients and what they don't use comes out on the other end in the form of honeydew that's conducive to black sooty mold. State field crews are working to try to prevent them from spreading. They're scraping egg masses or we have some uh, backpack vacuums that we suck up the nymphal stage um, as well as the, as the adults and we also do uh, some chemical treatment with bifenthrin. They don't bite, they don't sting, they're not a threat to humans. The first reported sighting of the insect was in Davidson County in Hermitage in 2023. Then in Wilson County a few months later. You can also play a role in detecting them. The department now has a survey you can fill out if you think you may have come across a spotted lanternfly. Type in protecttnforest.org and search report a pest. There you'll fill out questions about where you found it, its features, and there's also a space to upload a picture, which is the most important step. A lot of folks don't send a picture, and so without a picture, it's really hard for us to confirm or deny um, information that they're giving us. They're not common across the state yet, um, and we want to keep it that way. Corey Johnson, News 2.